Shifting and swinging are two fundamental activities in Bates' method, but what's the difference? With shifting, you shift your attention continuously from one point to another, pausing on each point just long enough to register that you are seeing it. With swinging, you develop your awareness of movement in relation to the centre of vision. Here I am shifting my attention between two points on the letter G. The pointer tells me where to look. First a point on the black curve of the letter, then a point on the white gap, then back to the point on the black. Whenever my attention lands on a point, I notice that I am looking at it and then move on. This is swinging and here I am following movement. The pointer is moving continuously and my attention follows it, giving me the impression that the letters are moving. The points on the letter G that I was shifting between are now part of a continuous series of points and I no longer notice individual points, I only notice the stream of movement that flows behind the tip of my pointer. With shifting, I notice that when my attention is on a point, I get a different impression of it than when my attention is on a different point. When I look away from the black to the white, it's as though the black becomes less distinct. Any point that is not in the centre of vision is not as distinct as the one point that is in the centre of vision. I can practice shifting my attention between a whole series of points and it doesn't just have to be the chart. The main thing is to be aware where you're looking and to develop this awareness. I'm looking at this point and I'm not looking at that point. Now I'm swinging a line of print. The pointer is moving along the white space underneath the letters and I'm following along the white space but I'm aware that the letters above where I'm following are actually moving in the opposite direction and this is swinging. Shifting and swinging are practiced separately. Shifting aims to narrow down the distance between the points that you can visually distinguish. Swinging brings awareness of movement using one small letter or a line of print or a whole panorama. And remember the most important part, as with any Bates practice, is to close your eyes and imagine. Imagine the letters shifting, imagine the letters swinging, and then look at them. See that letter G right at the centre of the screen. Just watch how it swings gently from side to side. Let your eyes be soft. Let your breathing be easy. Let your eyes blink. Take a good impression of it and then let your eyes close and remember.